Welcome to the perfume counter. My name is Stephanie and um, I can be of assistance to you today. Is there something that you needed help looking for? A gift for a friend? Okay. Yeah, I can definitely show you what we have. Uh, are you looking for more of a perfume or a body mist? A perfume. Okay, perfect. Um, we do have quite a few different ones, um, you are more than welcome to look at all of them, or do you just want me to show you, like, a few of our popular ones? All of them? Okay, I can do that. Um, does your friend like fruitier scents, or florally scents? You don't know. Okay, that's fine. Uh, we do have a satisfaction guarantee return policy, so if your friend ends up not liking the scent, uh, feel free to bring it back and we can definitely, you know, exchange it for something that would better suit them. Okay? Yeah. Uh, also, the deals for today, we do have a buy one, get one half off, or we also have the deal, um, where if you buy uh, $50 worth of perfume, you get a free um, gift set. Okay, great. Yeah, just something to keep in mind as we're going through them. Okay, yeah. Uh, the first one I can show you is this one here. The Christina Aguilera Red Sin. Packaging is really nice because it's like a red, lacy um, design. And it does smell kind of good. Well, it does smell good. Uh, it's a little stronger. It's more of it's definitely more of an adult like seductive fragrance. So this is what the bottle looks like. Very unique in shape. That's a little bit in here. But it says the name of it. Would you like to smell it? Okay. Yeah. Um, the only thing with this one is, uh, as you can see, the top it's very difficult to come off <laughs> um, but it's not that bad it's just very yeah it's very strong <laughs> so, let's spray this air out a little bit so this perfume here has hint of mm, smells good. What do you think? Yeah, it has a little bit of apple. Um, it has some ginger, some red ginger. It also has um, oh, what is it called? Uh, cyclamen. I think that's how you pronounce it. Don't ask me what it is, but, um, yeah, it smells good. Yeah, very fruity, um, but it's not, like, it's strong, but it's not too, like, overpowering, you know what I mean? Yeah. This one runs at about $32, and actually, I believe that this perfume is our more expensive one. So, what do you think? You want to think about it? Okay, not a problem. I'll put it to the side for you.
on the side for you. So this next one, um, you've probably heard of the original. It's the Britney Spears Fantasy. Uh, but this one is the Intimate Edition. And um, the box, I think, is so pretty. This one smells pretty good. I like the uh, original Fantasy. So if you are a fan of that, then you might like this one. bottle I think is so pretty. So it's white, just like the other fantasy, but the sub fantasy, like the original one was pink, um, like a pinky purple. This one is all white with a kind of rose gold design with some pink embellishments. I'll let you smell this one. This one has little hints of uh, lychee, lemon, jasmine, um, I believe it has some brown sugar and vanilla, and also a little musk as well. Some white musk to be specific. Yeah, this one smells really good. What do you think of that one? You like it? Yeah, it's not like, it's not too overpowering. And I think as you wear it during the day, it'll stay, but it'll get a little fainter. So it'll be very, like, girly smelling. It won't be too um, seductive, although it is called the Intimate Edition. Um, but it's like, very soft. You definitely want me to put this one aside. Okay. Yeah, I can definitely do that. I really like this one. Um, this one runs at about $25. Yeah, it's not too bad. No, we don't have any um, really high-end ones here. A lot of these perfumes that you see today, you can find, obviously at this perfume counter, but you can find them at a lot of, like, drug stores, too. Not actual drug stores, but you can get them at, like, you know, Walmart or Target or things like that in the future. Yeah, so I'll definitely put that one aside. Okay, so this next one is called, it's by Tommy Hilfiger. It's called Tommy Girl. In a very simple bottle and these are our smaller sizes of the well those two I believe were regular size um, sorry I forgot to tell you how many milliliters uh, this one is 50 milliliters or 1.6 fluid ounces and then the Britney Spears one was 30 milliliters or one foot down. So they do come in um, smaller, those ones come in smaller sizes if you want a more of a travel one. And then this one does come in a larger size. This one is 15 milliliters and it's half a fluid ounce. This one is kind of nice because it's more of a fresher, cleaner um, kind of scent. This is what it looks like. Very simple. Just a clear perfume. Like I said, it's very clean smelling. Mm. It's a little stronger as far as um like the freshness is a little strong at first, but It is pretty nice, yeah. This is good for like a lot of ages too, because it's not overpowering and it's very like subtle. Um, some of the notes that are in it are camellias, 
and black currants. Here, I'll have it now. Yeah, there's also some citrusy smells, a little bit of florals, and some sandalwood. I think it smells really good. See, it's very like, kind of reminds me of like clean laundry, but in a good way. Smell one more time. Yeah, it's not too bad. This one um, is about fifteen dollars. You can think about it. Okay. Yeah, this one is definitely a little more affordable. Um, like I said, if you wanted a bigger size, we can get a bigger size. These are just our testers that we have out. Okay. The next one is, uh, you've heard of Jake, uh, uh, sorry, Daisy by Mark Jacobs. Yeah, that one's very popular among the high-end uh, perfumes. But this one, if you like Daisy by Marc Jacobs, then you will like this. It's um, from the Designer Imposter Signature Collection. So it's a knockoff of Daisy by Marc Jacobs. Um, but it smells pretty much exactly like it. If not exactly, then very close. I'll take this out for you. And the nice thing about this one is uh, if you really like the scent of the Daisy perfume, like the original, that can run for like, what is it, like 50 or $60 or somewhere around there, then this is a great, very, very, very cheap alternative. This one is about $8. Yeah, it's a huge difference. But nonetheless, it still smells pretty good. So, that's what it looks like. And I will spray it for you. Yeah, this one is going to be a little more, uh, what's it called? A little florally, a little musky but it's a little sweet as well. Go ahead and smell this. Yeah. yeah, it's not bad. It is very similar to the original, yeah. So, um, the notes that are in this are the, uh, there's violet and strawberries. And then you have some hints of jasmine, you have that musk, and then you have a little bit of vanilla. Yeah. It does smell really good. Yeah. You're gonna think about this one too? Not a problem. Like I said, if you buy $50 worth of perfume today, you do get a free, um, be, uh, what's it called? Gift set. Um, I can definitely show you the gift set after um, you look at all the rest of them. And then we do have a buy one, get one half off. Which normally we aren't able to combine um, like offers like that. But you seem like a nice person, so. I think I can accommodate and swing both deals for you. Yeah, not a problem. Okay, so this next one is inspired, I think, by Fifty Shades of Grey. So it's definitely going to be a more seductive scent. Um, this is called Red Room, and it's called Shades of Love. Oh. Right here it says, 
uh, Fifty Shades of Love scent is not associated with the author or publishers of Fifty Shades of Grey. So it's not associated, but it was probably inspired by them in some way, I would think. And I like the bottle on this one, it's really pretty. ombre kind of bottle. Yeah. It's very, uh, very simple, but also, like, really nice to look at. It's very, very decorative. Yeah. So this one, um, it's more of a spicier scent. And it has, um, patchouli in it. This cap is also quite difficult to get off. Okay, so I'll go ahead and spray this one for you. Yeah, it's definitely a stronger, stronger scent. Yeah, sorry. I wish we had coffee beans for you to smell, but we're currently out. It's supposed to help clear up your um, nasal passages. I wouldn't suggest getting too close to it, but go ahead and smell that. Yeah, it's definitely stronger, but very seductive scent. It almost has like a more of like a vanilla undertone, kind of. No, not for you. Yeah, it's not bad, it's just very strong. You don't think your friend will like it? You kind of like it? Oh, you could get it for yourself. This one is only $10. Yeah, it is a little overwhelming, I agree. No, not really. Okay. So this next one is called uh, So So Madame. It's a Coco Chanel uh, knockoff, basically. And this one is also ten dollars. The one thing I love about this perfume is the box. Yeah, it's very, uh, very girly, very cute, but elegant at the same time. This is what it looks like. Go ahead and spray it for you. I'm not gonna lie to you, this one is not my favorite because yeah if you smell that some people like this this is more for our older clientele it smells like an old lady like a very elderly grandmother no I didn't think so it's not my favorite Yeah, I can tell you what's in it. Uh, there's some spiciness again, like the last one. There's coriander, pomegranate, uh, cloves, orange blossom, sandalwood, and little hints of vanilla. Yeah, the coriander and the cloves really are very prominent um, scents. <coughs> all this perfume. I know, uh, you'd think being around it all day, I'd get used to it. Nope. Okay, so those are all of the perfumes that I have to show you. Um, 
before you make a final decision, I can show you the gift set if you'd like. The one that if you spend 50 or more you get for free as a gift with purchase. Okay. So I have it right here. It's um, Katy Perry's Mad Potion. So it comes with a body lotion, a shower gel, and it comes with um, half a fluid ounce of her perfume. If you want, I can open this one up to let you smell it. Yeah, sure. I can definitely do that. Yeah, this one smells really good. Um, I don't want to say it's strong, but it's a very sweet smell. get it out of this plastic here. I really packaged these in. <laughs> I don't think it's going to be quiet. It's a nice purple liquid, so it's really pretty. Yeah, I'll let you smell it. So this has more of a uh, kind of a fruitier scent, but also very sweet, like a, like a frosting, I guess. Um, it has some vanilla, some apples, like a crisp apple, and has some jasmine. Um, a little bit of musk and amber. I usually love amber. Yeah, one of my favorite body mists actually um, is an amber scent. Yeah, it's so good. Yeah, it's very, very sweet. Kind of strong. What do you think? I mean, you get it for free, so you can give it to your friend as well or give it to someone else. Okay, well, I mean, you don't have to have it, but if you do reach the $50, you do get it for free if you like. Okay? Yeah, not a problem. So, I'll just put it back here. Um, and like I said, it also comes with the body lotion and the shower gel. And like a nice little gift set. Yeah, there's a lot of different choices. <laughs> Which ones, um, oh, by the way, the gift set is about a $20 value. Yeah. And, I mean, if you don't reach the 50 you could always purchase it on its own. So, yeah. So which ones do you think your friend would enjoy the most? Britney Spears fantasy? Okay. Whoops. I'm knocking it over. So I'll go with fantasy, intimate edition. Alright. And the Tommy Girl? Yeah. 
It smells so good. It's very clean, very fresh. writing up your receipt here. We're very old fashioned. We like to write things down. So fantasy. And that came to twenty-five. Then we have Tommy Girl. And that runs at about fifteen. Oh, you, you like the daisy? Yeah? Okay. You want to buy that for yourself? Yeah, no. Not a problem at all. You might as well get yourself something nice. A daisy. So daisy is eight. Your total today is fifty three dollars. Um, oh, I did say it was buy one get one half off. So what I can do is I can do the daisy at half off. So that brings it down to forty nine. And you know what? You're at forty nine dollars. Um, I can throw in the free gift. It's one extra dollar, so it doesn't even matter. Um, forty nine is close to fifty. Uh, did you want the gift with purchase? No. Okay, that's fine. So your total today comes to forty nine dollars. Um, I just need you to sign. up for you. Yeah, I think your friend will really enjoy it. So get a daisy for you. Britney Spears Fantasy. And Tommy Girl. Was there anything else I could do for you today? No? Okay. That was so nice to meet you. Yeah, I hope your friend really enjoys their gift. And like I said, satisfaction guarantee, so if they don't like it, just feel free to bring it back in. And we'll, um, we can go through the perfumes again and find something that they like a little better. Yeah, yeah you're very welcome. Enjoy the rest of your day.